Good evening, I'm Will McAvoy. With me tonight, the host of The Late Late Show on CBS, James Corden. James, thank you for being here. Oh, uh, thank you for having me. I want to start out by talking about the current state of late night television. It seems that it is flooded with competition more than ever. Uh, it's, it's certainly an exciting time. I, I mean, uh, what I've learned is the thing about late night television is, is that you're watching for the personality, you know? It, it's, it's the person behind it. I'm sorry, what are you doing? <laughs> Sorry, boss. It's just, it's really heavy. I apologize, James. We've got a new intern starting out today. That's all right. I'm okay. I got better grip on it now. James, why don't, we, uh, why don't you talk to me about the uh, diversity in late night? I, I think it's exciting to see what, you know, Chelsea Handler's going to do uh, at Netflix. Uh, Samantha Bee, who is an incredibly talented performer, has got her own show that's about to start on TBS. <laughs> What are you doing? Oh, I just can't hold Bloom and the selfie stick. Well, why do you have a selfie stick? I don't understand the question. Just put the selfie stick down. All right, fine. Says here you were born in Grand Rapids, Michigan. You're 48 years old, and you have two kids. Uh, but, um, I do have two kids. I'm, I'm actually I'm 37 years old. I was born in the UK. Really? Because it uh, says... I'm sorry, who compiled this research? I did. It's all wrong. Oh, no. No, it says right here, born in Grand Rapids, Michigan, age 48, kids two, named Andy Ritker. I'm, I'm not Andy Ritker. This is James Corden. Really? Wow. Looks exactly like Andy Ritker. I apologize, James. It's fine. Honestly, don't... You've got something on your face. <laughs> You know what? You are what's wrong with television today. You. Used to be that you had to be skilled, hardworking to make it in TV, but not anymore. There are two things in this world that give me an ulcer. Indian food and people like you. You know, television used to teach, used to inspire, but now it's just a competition between who's dumb and who's dumber. I spent four years in undergrad, three years in law school, and then another 15 as a prosecutor for the Brooklyn District Attorney's Office before I even thought about setting foot in a television studio. You? You watch broadcast news on Netflix. <laughs> but TV can be great again. The strong voices, we don't need to shout to be heard. We can make it great again. That is our duty. He <laughs> said, duty. <laughs> How can you possibly be so immature? <laughs> you too? Duty's pretty funny. <laughs> duty. We'll be back right after these messages. I'm sorry, but duty's pretty funny. <laughs> <laughs> duty. <laughs>